Yeah, my fat wall. My small small is the start. Hey guys, good morning. Today I'm forcing some people out. Hey, yeah, let's go now. <laughs> That's my bouncer. <laughs> That's my bouncer behind me. <laughs> Say hi. Bouncer. This is your You don't have respect for your madam. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh Lord, we are going out by force. By force. <laughs> I bribed him for us to go out today because he's supposed to be sleeping. Abby, <laughs> look, I say hi now. Why you did like that? Say hi. I don't know them. You don't know them. <laughs> He's denying you people. He said he does not know you. Did you say well? Yes, now. Here's another part of school I didn't show in the last vlog. This is the first time I'm eating burger in the, U in the UK. And their burger tastes like actual meat, unlike the ones in the US. Tastes really good. We bought from Burger King. Hi, guys. I'm doing this in a very big hurry. I don't even know if you guys can hear me. I don't have my hair pod and I don't have my mic. But I've been on Go 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 this morning. Uh, some unnecessary trips that I've made what I was going to look for I couldn't get it anyways my sister is coming today and I'm heading to the train station to go pick them up I'm really excited to see my sister and of course my niece so let's go hello Wuka. mama Coffee. What are we going to buy? Uh, you forgot it. Huh? What are we going to buy? Uh, onions. Onions. Good girl. <laughs> hi guys. So say hi guys. Hi guys. <laughs> we are going to buy onions. Yeah. <laughs> I'm picking her out so that mom can rest. She has been disturbing her mom. There's a dog. Yeah. It's a dog. It's a dog, you tell me. It's a dog. It's a dog? Yeah. It's a dog. Oh, we are going to get something so that I can cook. So yeah. I'm just using the opportunity to take her out so that her mom can rest a bit. Yeah. Ah, it's been fun having them around. So yeah. much fun. Yeah. This way. Yeah. Let's go. Yay. 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 <coughs> Come on, Bashay. Come on, Bashay. Hey, my cookbook with the Jabo Miko. 
Yes, sir. If you are in the environment, I'm collecting money. If you want to make your hair. I need to I need to find I need I I'm being caught now. We are cutting and we are starting. Thank you, Mama. Sorry, baby. Mama, what a blur! Oh, cut, cut, oh, cut, cut, nishe. Hey, Adam. Huh? You auntie said that you are waking up in the, the first thing you do when you wake up in the morning is to watch that. Mama, yeah. what will you say to her? You can't say nothing because you don't have any defense. Uh, when you wake up in the morning, what do you do first? Brush your teeth. Eh? Brush your teeth. Brush your teeth. <laughs> have you brushed your teeth? But now? you have brushed your teeth now. You're watching tap. Let's check another one. Hey, brush my teeth. I've gotten it, but no, it's not the. Um, it's not firm. I want it to be firm. But my video is here now. Mm hmm. Go. See. Can you see? It's not firm. Let's do that again. Mommy, let's do that again. What is what again? This is my tab again. Hmm? This is my tab. Your tab? Yeah. And what happened to your tab? And then. Cover your mouth when you are coughing, Adam. Oh, I lose it again. Shall we? It's not okay. Eh, but tight, eh? Come at you. Got to move, man. It's my too. Oh, it's okay. No, you put that like it's okay. It's not okay. It's kind of wild. I'm the one that is saying it. Yeah, it's not firm enough. It's, it would be firm when no. I went to do it in the salon the other time. It wasn't firm either. They are fake. <laughs> <laughs> I see. Are you the hairdresser? It was not firm. Uh, gel and dryer. Last week, last last. Uh, gel. You don't gel. You don't have. You bought fake gel. Uh -huh. So am I? Dryer. You dry. don't have. Apologies. We'll dry it. Thank God it's winter. Or something that looks like it. I can't do it, Vanessa. I said I'll do it for you. I can't do it, Vanessa. Messi, 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 Messi. What? Give me a touch on it. Since 20, 2019. Give me another one. No, no, so my dress, I cannot even do this one. Yeah, mom. Eh, hey. the one I did, two of them, two of them. And my hair was even relaxed then. Make G. Say my hand no strong. Make me start kicking. My hand no strong. <laughs> At the end of the day, rubbish, you know, the shit. I shall have a jersey. I want to dry her. Everything came out fine. A sister to the profession. <laughs> I'm not professional. I'm a professional impersonator. <laughs> I'm not professional, I'm professional in person, exactly. And it's not like anybody is paying me for the air I'm doing. Please don't insult me. I'll pay. It's not like anybody is paying me. So Name your price. We have done our part. Name your price. Stop Ibini. embarrassing me to my fans. Ibini Oluwara Milowo Day. Ibini Zeri. So, I have tried my best. Hi. 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 Hello in France. Hello in France. <laughs> hello in France. Hello in France. What are you saying? Yeah, say hello to the camera. Hello. 
Hello. What's your name? Adun. 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 Oh, my pronouns Annie. Adun. Is it Adun? Adun. Lua. Adula. Adala. Adula. My name is Teddy. Oh, your name is Teddy. Show us your Teddy. Daddy, my name is Teddy. Your name is Teddy. Good girl. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you, mommy. My name is mommy. Yeah. Okay. And what is our name? Mo. Mm. Mo. Mm. Yeah. Mo. <laughs> what is her name? Da. Mo. Da. Da. Uh huh. Mo. Mo. La. La. Good girl. <laughs> Clap for yourself. <laughs> What is her name? Go back. Move to the back a bit. Uh -huh. What is her name? Da. Uh -huh. Mo. Mo. La. Good girl. It's not Kalala again. It's not Kalala. <laughs> is it Kalala? No. 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 <laughs> it's now Da. Mo. Da. What does your mom pronounce it here? You pronounce it with the syllable. Small, small. Da. Da. Mo. Da. Mo. Okay, da. I want to use this one. Yeah, but don't worry. Don't worry. Report me later. No. So, when the monster will come and catch you. Eh, I don't want to sleep in. I said, Mo. 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 Mommy, mm. eh, da, ma, la, <laughs> said that monster will come back. <laughs> and I was sleeping, I had monster. I was like, which one is monster? What is the one? You think I didn't sleep? And I think, two things were doing. I get up and pass. Mommy, my yeah. teddy daddy. Your teddy is what? It's daddy. It's daddy. It's daddy. You're for lollipop. For what? Lollipop. 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 Who uh, uses lollipop? Lollipop. 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 lollipop? Is it not you? Yeah. Is so you? Why so you be the one to wash it too? But you want it. Who wants it? Me. Why should we use it for Oh, you're about to wash it for me. Why should we use it for you? Bye. We're going back home. Jacket very well. <laughs> Careful. You are going to your house. You are going to your house. But you go and take the train. Yeah. <laughs> What? You see what I like it? Mm. Mm. <laughs> uh -oh. Mm. Uh -oh. Mm. Mm. Uh -oh. Move, move, move. Mm. Let me hold you. Mm. Mm. I need black. Mm. I need black mask. Just mask every mother in my room. Wow. Okay, baby, buy real. I do, don't go near the tree. Jesus. Hi guys. How are you guys doing? I just got back home now. And for some reason I decided to start recording. Can you guys see me properly? It's four o'clock. Four zero three. And it already looks like it's ten PM outside. Anyways. Gosh. How are you guys doing? It's been a while I vlogged. I didn't plan on vlogging. I just came in and picked up my camera. Ah, 
Today is a cold day. It's been so cold this last couple of days. I like my drip today. <laughs> I didn't know. I said I didn't know that. Uh, what they call it? Whatever joggers, joggers. That's what I'm trying to remember. Apparently, they actually, if you buy the thick one, it really helps with the cold. I realized that even when I'm wearing jeans, unless I'm like layering up, layering up, I still get very, very cold. Um, but every time I'm wearing the joggers, it's so good, especially if you buy the like thick original ones. Original ones, <laughs> Nigeria mentality, like this fake one, <laughs> the thicker ones, right? And I actually like this. I went to Primark today and I bought another one. I bought a navy blue one. That was the one I was wearing. Every day I was going to school, I would always wear that one. I wear leggings under and it's easy to wear something under. Um, so I realized that, oh, it's actually better. I feel warmer in my legs, you know, because you're wearing jacket. You're not wearing jacket on your legs. Um, <sighs> where was I? Uh -huh. So yeah so it's really been insulating me i don't know if i'm done talking about the trouser but anyways yeah so today uh, so for the past like i think since like two three days now it's been really cold um like we've been going towards between five degrees to one degree my sister's place in bradford they've been in one degree before <laughs> so when they came here the last time i couldn't vlog a lot because you know when they, they came in she only spent the night <laughs> she thought she'd be coming back she, she was saying she wished she had like made her you know she had planned early and you know planned to stay multiple days because she really need she really needed the rest um especially because i was there to you know look after adun one all so anyways um she came it was really fun and exciting like it was so good to have them around so anyways um so that happened they've left you know they of course they've, it's been like a week now since they left today is today is monday so i had a class early today i went even though we just went there the man immediately we got there the professor asked us to just go and work on our project so um schooling in the uk and the us is so different i think i'm going to do like a proper video analyzing both because i'm almost done with one semester already <laughs> um basically we are done i'm done for all of my classes today is um today is november 27th i'm already done with all my classes so now i'm working on my project right my independent project it involves building an app um interviewing creating social media content creating news content and stuff like that which are things i actually enjoy doing i think one thing that really excites me about this semester is you know i was able to challenge myself when they told us we're going to do an app majority of people just outs outsource it to you know people in nigeria to help them to build it and all but i was going to do the same but i said why not just try i mean what's the essence of being in class if you actually won't try and you know based on what we're being taught in class i was able to like come up and develop my app it was so like it feels so fulfilling to actually do that and that's why i really love the course i'm currently doing because it's more practical it's more hands-on and i realized i actually love the practical and hands-on parts than the research who loves research the research we're constantly being made to do in the US, like US studies is just research, research focus. And this has been really helpful. We've done you, um, user experience, UI UX, creating video content. Like we literally work with the camera, work with, you know, um, audio recording. They teach us how to use Adobe and stuff like that, which makes it so, so fun. Anyways, this is not the video <laughs> for that. Okay. So yeah. Um, like I said, I just got in, um, so yeah, I went to class in the morning. So when we got to class, the professor said he doesn't have anything to teach because we are done with, he's done, all the professors are done teaching. So now it's left to you to go and work on your projects. And if you need help, you come to your lectures and then you and your professor will talk. So I literally got to class, collected the attendance code and we left to go and do my work. I was going to go to the library to continue my paper because that's why I've not, like vlogged since my sister left over a week ago 
I have constantly been in the library working on my because one of the subjects I'm doing actually requires you to write a 5,000 word essay and all of that and I'm just stuck in a theoretical perspective anyway see guys I'm boring I'm boring you guys <laughs> anyway so um uh what was i saying so yeah but today i couldn't do that because my husband needed a few things um his work rarely permits him to go out to like go for shopping and stuff like that so he needed a few things for um for the winter weather that would help him with his commute from here to work so i went to primark guys everything's so bad <laughs> ah, i'm so tired guys <laughs> see guys if you're in the UK and you know this rice, you better be careful, okay? Normally, when I buy this rice, I only, since we came, I only buy 5 kg at a time. I've never bought the bigger one, mostly because I'm the one going to buy them most times. You know, I'm the one that go for, goes for the shopping. And um, my husband is not there to help me. I cannot be carrying 10 kg up and down. So I only buy 5 kg because it's easier to carry. But the last time me and my husband went shopping, right? You guys, I vlogged a little bit. So when we're coming back, I bought 10 kg of this bag and of this rice and apparently it was a fake rice I bought. I did not know that they were producing fake of this rice. It's um, Island Sun. Every other while I've been buying this rice, I've never had issues with it until I bought the 10 kg. And imagine, it's the day I bought 10 kg that I went to buy fake. I wanted to cry because now the problem is if it was a different type of rice, I mean I could manage it but the problem is they mixed two types of rice so and one cooks so quick the other one takes time to cook so when you am cooking the rice it's so difficult if you cook it too long it will be some of them will be um, like pudding and then others will be strong and if you cook it too quick some will be well cooked others will be underdone it's the most annoying thing ever and I never expected it you know you know those things you expect it in nigeria you don't expect it over here but trust me thief thief is everywhere there is no country that does not have tea free uh so now i have 10 kg in my house i don't know what to do with it because i can't cook that rice we can't eat it every time we try like we we've, we've tried see i you can say me i can't you know me i don't have patience for rubbish but my husband he will tell you that we should eat it <laughs> that we should we should manage it but even he himself you know he couldn't he couldn't stand it so i went somewhere else and i bought this one and with the look of it i think it looks good but let's keep our fingers crossed okay okay so um then i then oh and then so i left class and then i went to primark to buy um all these ones I'm remo removing, they are not, these are groceries that I went to buy after leaving Primark. So, <sighs> honestly, I try to buy a lot of things, in, a lot of things in bulk, but me and my husband, me, not my husband, let me lie against him. I usually have like weird cravings of food so that I always have to go to the market to buy ingredients for. But certain things are unavoidable. Like I had to, so I got this sweater right for him i got this one too this is a fleece jacket like a fleece sweater this one like trust me it's good quality um they are more expensive than the normal one i i got for him initially those ones they don't hold cold well um but these ones are really good so i'm sure this will keep him warm anyways and i did uh, a collaboration with timo um they already sent a few winter things but i mistakenly put my sister's address so i have to go when I, i'll be going to for my brother-in-law's graduation next week so when i go over there i'm going to take it so so I, then i went to the grocery store i bought bread for my husband because i don't eat it um anymore i got this this uh bell peppers I got them three for one pound each. Yeah, three for one pound. Three for two pound. No, three for one pound each. I got this. I got, I'm out of dish. I'm almost out. I don't like to run out before I buy more. I'm almost out of dish soap. I got those. I got, well, I would have brought it out and for me, I don't have strength. Ah, it's 15. It's 15 in there, so. 
that should last us a while um of course i got rice i got some body spray um cling film because uh when i pack my husband's food to work sometimes it the oil seeps out so to prevent it from doing that i learned this from my sister when i pack it and i use the film to like wrap it up and it helps to keep it tight right so so important <laughs> um these are the bread this is the bread i buy i bought uh and then oops i'm almost out of seasoning cubes the seasoning cubes i've been using for the past it's almost three months now um, it's the one my mom sent from nigeria apparently anything that has chicken they don't let you to send it so she had to remove it and then start to um break it inside the jar inside a ziploc you know she really really tried like she had to literally remove it and unwrap one them one after the other after she got to where she was gonna ship them so yeah i got that i got some olive oil this one too i don't like to run out um so i always have one extra so once i open this one i have to buy one more um yeah this is what i used to cook most times and thankfully because i have my air fryer now it makes it so easy to save on oil so i don't have to like deep fry my chicken or deep fry anything the air fryer has been helping me it's a godsend i'm telling you guys the moment i'm done boiling i just pop it in within 10 minutes as crispy as anything else so nice i'm enjoying it i'm not even gonna lie so i just um I don't even use this for the air fryer. I have a spray oil that I just spray just one, two, three on it, and that's it. Sometimes I don't even need to spray it because chicken already or turkey already has oil in it, right? I bought a yam. I've heard people complain about well, this is plantain. They usually sell it four for one pound. So I bought just four because it, it's not they didn't really have fresh ones. So I I feel like we've eaten more plantain here than we ever ate in Nigeria because even in Nigeria we use this plantain every time. <laughs> like I said, I think some people have been complaining about yam. I've, this last time that I bought yam was actually the first time I bought bad yam. Since I came out, the yam I've been buying really good. Never had issues with them. So I just bought this one, Shan. This one looks good, right? This I bought for five fifty. I usually wrap it because it's dusty. So basically, those are the groceries that I bought, right? But um, last week, so when my sister came, she had to help me make my hair. And it was so stressful for us because I did not have a hair dryer. I've been saying I was going to get one. I just never, I just don't know. I never ever get around to getting one. I always postpone and postpone and postpone. So thankfully I was able to get this, but let me clear this place first because you guys know me, I'm Clutter.